morning everyone welcome back to the channel captain mike b here back at it again with another video so today we're going to be talking about the mega rayquaza raid counters so if you guys are ready let's get right through it so mega rayquaza is finally in the uh, pokemon go so mega rayquaza is a dragon type pokemon with a uh, attack value of 309 and the defense value of 177 cp of this pokemon will be 88,200. hp is 22,500. And this Pokemon is double weakness to ice, single weakness to rock, dragon, and fairy type. The perfect IB for this Pokemon at max CP at level 40 will be 5713. Max CP at level 50 will be 6458. So this Pokemon will be a beast. And Rayquaza can be caught the following CP values. 2190 CP no weather boost. 2739 CP boosted by Windy Weather Boost at 100%. Rayquaza is one of the most unique Mega Evolution to come to Pokemon Go based on its requirement. In order to get Mega Rayquaza, you will need not only 400 Mega Energy but also its signature move, Dragon Ascent, which will only be obtained through use of a meteorite item. After that, as long as you remove Dragon Ascent, it will cost 80 Mega Energy. To mega evolve the same Rayquaza so make sure that you get those uh, meteorite from the research that you guys are doing and you know, especially if you have the ticket in go fast go ahead and finish those research and get those meteorite to teach mega Rayquaza the move dragon set before you be able to mega evolve them to mega Rayquaza like all mega Rayquaza raid bosses you can catch a shiny version of it from the raids but the ratio of it it's gonna be low I'm pretty sure because most of the time uh, if they do have like a mega raid bosses they don't give out shinies like that easy so make sure you do a lot of mega raid Rayquaza all right let's go to the um, mega Rayquaza raid counters now at number one will be a shadow mammoth swine with power of snow and avalanche followed by shadow Mewtwo with psycho cut and its ice beam Followed by Mama Swine with Powder Snow and Avalanche, the regular one. Followed by Mega Glalie with Frost Breath and Avalanche. Followed by Mega Bomba Snow with Powder Snow and Weather Ball. Followed by Mega Rayquaza itself by Dragon Tail with and Breaking Swipe. Followed by Glaceon with Frost Breath and Avalanche. Followed by Shadow Weavile, Ice Shard and Avalanche. Followed by Mewtwo with Psycho Cut and Ice Beam. Followed by Weavile with Ice Shard and Avalanche, followed by Walrus with Frost Breath and Icicle Spear, followed by Mega Gardevoir with Charm and Dazzling Gleam. Now going on to the next set of um, counters, we have Shadow Ursa Luna with Tackle and Ice Punch, followed by Shadow Articuno with Frost Breath and Ice Beam, followed by Avalog with Ice Fang and Avalanche, followed by Aurorus with Frost Breath and Weather Ball, followed by Shadow Alola Ninetales, with Powder Snow and Weather Ball and followed by Shadow Lapras with Frost Breath and Ice Beam. Now going on to the next set of um, counters, we have Galar and Dermatitan with Ice Fang and Avalanche. We have Shadow Reggie Ice with Frost Breath and Blizzard. Followed by Beer Tick with Powder Snow and Ice Punch. Followed by Isubihan Avalog with Powder Snow and Blizzard. Followed by Vanillux with Frost Breath and Blizzard. Shadow Cloyster with Frostbred and Avalanche and that's pretty much it for the Mega Raid counters. I hope you guys found this uh, video helpful and informational. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I hope to see you all in the next one. This is Captain Mike B signing out. Peace and have a good day.